Fantastic. Oh, that's awesome. I wasn't sure um, Legendary Healer would proc on um, items. That's awesome, though. Okay. So we got this gunner and this assassin knight. We got to take him out. just so that she's a little bit safer. Ugh, I need to review it. Okay, fine. Whatever. Tasted now, though. She's blind, so she could heal to him. Or we can do... Not tap there. Um, I burn all. You can do quit to coddle. One thirty one with a nineteen percent chance to hit. Holy crap. The line really messes her up a lot. Okay, so we'll just we'll heal Yates. I uh, probably should have pinned AC at him, but that's fine. Move her up here. And I'll revive next turn. He's mute. Still hit for decent. It's kind of surprising how hard he can hit. 16, Jelly Man Seed, Water, um, Thunder. Lance Thunder. 70. Oh, so close. Um, let's do this and do pull star. Okay, he's gonna come along and Blackblade, yeah, not surprising. Okay. Yates is not dead yet. <laughs> what do we get? Just really? Wow. A whole distilled water. I'm so happy that we got that. <laughs> Just wow. <laughs> All right, Septimus. Screw off. Jackass. So we can kill him. Do a big chunk of damage, Septimus. Let's kill him. The gunner's gonna kill Yates. Are you kidding me? 2 HP? It's fine, Yates will res. Stop res. Okay. She's still freaking blind. Okay. Fine. Line wars off. He can thunder this fine. 
All right, he's dead. Seth is gonna get his turn and probably come kill. Z oh, interesting. Okay. Totally okay with that exchange. Alright, so he's gonna afflict him with bleed. Kinda think and take out the gunner. Which we can just about do. Mr. Gunner. Nice knowing you. Nice, another energized crystal. Um, Bizarro, you're gonna come over here and you don't have lick wounds anymore, do you? So you are going to you can heal yourself. His healing is much better now. I guess his mind, wow, his mind and his defense skyrocketed. Why, Jesus, his defense is high. Is that Pectite that does that? Holy crap. Jeez. I need to give him some accessories that boost resistance then and, and like his mind is halfway decent yeah yeah so I need to give him some, some stuff that makes him halfway decent to uh, resistance and boosts mind as well and he'll be he'll just be good to go all right Septimus I mean, that charm would be bothersome. <laughs> Except I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure you're going to be dead before it, it becomes a problem. Because Kyrie has her turn and she can do your whole life in, in, a, in one attack. <laughs> this is ridiculous. If this wasn't very hard. Oh, Jesus Christ. Sorry if you're religious. I don't, don't mean to be blasphemous, but. <laughs> if this wasn't very hard. Yeah, I mean, if, if it. <laughs> If this was normal, I would feel bad about using it because it's so strong. I feel that this makes it more in line with probably how normal feels. Like, the fights can still be a challenge. You know, I still have people drop and, and there's still some danger, right? Um, yeah, I think if I was playing this on normal or, or lower or something, this would just be dumb. Like, I could solo maps with her. On normal or something, I think. <laughs> I just want to see the damage. And he missed, but still, that was practically 900 damage. He got nerfed too after people complained. Okay. And then Very Hard was there. Okay, well, let's give you an even extra challenge for Hard. Over Hard. Oh, oh, fresh coronal plume. I can make a princess. Or, no, it takes two. Right? Oh, well. All right, all right, you caught me. Man, 
I surrender. So it was your magic we detected. Septimus, we sent you using immortal magic without council approval. Explain yourself. It was her. She attacked me in town unprovoked like a rabid animal. I had no choice but to defend myself. Surely you would not sanction me for that. I wonder if I understand you correctly. Hey, Revert. Revert. Ugh, sorry. How's it going? Yeah. Um... Yeah, if I was playing hard or below, I don't even know if I would... If using the grinded out Soul Eater and Soul armor like I still feel like even on hard it would feel unfair like it almost feels unfair on very hard because she can pretty much one shot almost anything as long as I handle it correctly but I feel that's okay on very hard because the fights are still challenging like I still have to play smart I can't just do whatever I feel like because I can still lose but whereas on lower difficulty, I think the damage numbers, yeah, the da I, I feel on, on hard or lower, the incoming damage numbers would be low enough or, or lower enough that she could roll over everything. And I wouldn't, I wouldn't have any danger. Like I could put her in a healer on a map and she could solo the map with, with some heals. Um, and that would be unfair. And, you know, that might be fun for just a raffle stomp playthrough, but uh, I don't think it would be challenging. Um, I still feel like there's a challenge on Very Hard, even with her being able to wreck things this way. Um, what, is it, what does it call when you've got a sports team and you've got that, that one player that's your, your go-to to win the game? Counterattack plus life leech. And then Shield of the Six. Yeah, I was looking at Shield of the Six. That's pretty tempting to give immunity to the normal elements. Where does Life Leech come from? Is that Vamp? No, it's not Vampire. Um, is that Lord? Or Princess? Or is that Duelist? There's a couple of class I, classes I haven't unlocked yet, so I'll have to check those. But yeah, that could be pretty strong build too you just move in and yeah okay I need to unlock dual list um, although for Kyrie at least I still want to try the specific build out which is just pure damage there's two builds I want to try I think I told you um, they're pure damage but that could be a good like own everything build <laughs> like unkillable and then just okay you take more take more holy damage but you're gonna life leech everything back as soon as you're attacked because of counter attack <coughs> I wonder if I understand you correctly you claim that one of our most stalwart arbiters came across a, a member of the council taking a stroll and decided to attack him for no reason whatsoever is that skepticism in your voice? How dare you? Hmm, right. Would you care to speculate as to what would motivate an arbiter to attack a member of the very council to which she has sworn her life? What kind of a question is that? How could I guess at this reprobate's m motive? Possibly it's some side effect of her being marked. We all know the pilgrimage is a chaotic time. Well met, Captain Kyrie. Quintus, Tertia, would you please share your version of this troubling event? Of course. We were on the last leg of the pilgrimage, on our way to Gogombob City, when we were ambushed. We had eliminated a few of the assassins, and the tide had begun to turn our way when Septimus appeared. He complained that his lackeys were taking too long, and joined the fray himself. As you can see, he failed. What despicable lies. Better for you to confess, Arbiter, my integrity. 
Septimus, you know the protocol for these proceedings. You had your say, now let the captain speak. That was a grievous accusation, Kyrie. What reasons could drive Septimus to attempt to murder you and your team? A fair question, Quintus. During our recent travels, we discovered that bandits who had sacked a number of towns in the region were working hand-in-hand -hand with Arbiters. We later learned they were taking their marching orders directly from Septimus. I myself was present and witnessed as much with my own eyes. He was willing to do anything in his power to ensure this information never reached the council. Nonsense. Lies. All of it. These are very serious claims, Kyrie. This cannot be decided solely on the testimony of an arbiter, especially when the other party is an immortal. The council will investigate the claims on both sides and render a judgment. Considering the gravity of the matter, it may take quite a long while to come to a decision. But until a conclusion is reached, you will resume your pilgrimage. I understand. I would also like to report our findings about the relics. We uncovered a plot by Sigil to drain the... Primus already told us about it. Have no worries. I see. Come, Septimus. The council will need to convene on this matter. Wow. Hmm, they seem to know everything about the relics already. I wonder what Primus told them ex exactly. Not a bad result, all things considered. Simply surviving an assault from an immortal is a small miracle in itself, but walking away afterwards with the council's blessing tops even that. I don't understand. Quintus made it clear they wouldn't trust our word against Septimus's, and yet they're just letting us go? The child could see Septimus was lying, and badly, but obviously the council can't push him based on nothing but our word. But why let us go? Quintus made it clear the council's deliberations would be quite lengthy, giving us ample time to complete the pilgrimage. Once the pilgrimage is complete, Kyrie can be selected as an immortal. Then it will be the word of one immortal against another, and since we are in the right, justice will prevail. But you are so capable in these thorny situations, so wise. I wonder, will I ever become so adept? <laughs> You've a few more years yet to catch up. More experience is all that's needed. Trust me, I know of what I speak. Come, we should be as quick as about this as possible. Let's go. And on that note, we're going to do some patrols and side missions now. <laughs> because we've got a couple of hunts and a couple of... We've got a couple of hunts and a large-scale battle. And I have to get that treasure. Might actually try and get the, uh, the treasure chest we're missing. Oops, what did I do? Oh, that's right. It's okay, I did the right thing. Uh, bounty hunter no weakness to so that her crit is absurd just what I wanted and then pectite adaptive infinity adaptive affinity that's good okay. all right um yeah let's go ahead and do I missed the Rift Walkers. Rainer's got the Battle Claw. Let's put the Ever Bloom on her for now. And we will put, instead of the Spiked Shoes, we will put the Rift Walkers on him. Okay. The shop. Can we buy new stuff? Always curious about new stuff. Uh, it's not looking like it. No. Nope. Nope. Okay. No new stuff. That's fine. All right. So. Oh. Okay. Um. Foul boil. Let's check and see what that is. 
Dark Rapier for Dark Deeds. It does Dark Element. Plus 5 Accuracy, plus 5 Debuff Chance. I mean, that's... That is pretty decent. But... Um, actually, let's... Just while I'm thinking about it. Um, what are we missing? We don't have... Leech Life, Bloodwork. Okay, so that's Duelist. We need Peddler 3 and Reaver 3. That's the only one I'm missing. Um, well, it's not the only one. So, Peddler 3 and Reaver 3. She has... Re Peddler... She can't even be a Peddler. She needs Ranger 5, which is Ranger 4. So I need Peddler 3 and... Reaver 3. Okay. Okay, so we're getting there. So, crafting. What did I unlock? Ooh, something new. Something new. What did I get? Plane walkers. Two move. Jet boots. We already saw before. Plane walkers. Plus two move. That's nice. Um, okay. Do I make some plane walkers who would I put them on Kyrie give her six you know someone six or seven move which seems pretty strong my ideal bets would be Kyrie or Anadine since they're melee mostly melee but don't worry. think about it. Don't have to decide right this second. Um, save. So a reaver and reaver and ranger right now, and peddler after, right? Okay. Um, ability points. Little luck. Okay, well, whatever. So we'll do Reaver for that. Sure. Whatever. And then one more in hope. I need more IP for that one. So we'll do this one. Bring a healer if you don't like loud noises. Okay. Can bring a healer. Um, so I need to find a healer. Doctor. Wizard. Here you got healing spells. And then we need to ranger. Range Reaver and Where's my peddler? I know I have a peddler. I don't have a peddler anymore. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. So before we do that patrol, I'm going to change... someone to a peddler oh there's my peddler right there right so okay oh well So my peddler is right here, so I'll send her on missions. Okay. Save again, and then we'll do this patrol. No oh good. We 
started on a good ver uh, the good patrol path from what you said so yeah we'll put him on um, we'll put him on put her on he's got flight and float perfect so put him on and we'll put not entity put Yates on And so we got the Zot Zot. Deft Kawa, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. So we'll move here. Just to bait out some stuff. That's oh, fine. It's not gonna hurt too bad yet. And then we're gonna get slowed for it. Okay, there's a hidden enemy. Good to know. Okay, Rainer is going to. Sure. He's gonna come forward and just attack, okay. And die for it. Nice. So that's a bunch of bonus AP. Counter shot doing some work. Holy crap. And we got level up. Gunner, werewolf, and raging bullet. It's fine. Perfectly fine because she's gonna panacea. correct all right so we open this and we get a cursed shield okay so that's how was it cursed shield equipped 15 battles it becomes shield of the six if I remember right Definitely love the double crits. And of course, they're gonna res dudes, cause why wouldn't they? Uh, okay. no, that's fine. Come in here where I can AOE you guys. And I got people that are good with AOE. 